kind of been test positive for a woman's uh, infertility drug uh, today ahead of his fight with Chris Eubank. <laughs> What's your thoughts on the situation? I don't know, man. Today, today is different, man. Mm. You got men testing positive for women's stuff. Women want to be men. Men want to be women. I don't know what they expect, man. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it was something that probably tried to cover something else that he been taking. I don't know. I don't know what to say about that. But hey. is PEDs like something that we should just get used to at the top level of boxing? For sure. I think everybody taking it except for. Uh, the the real very skilled, you know what I'm saying? Everybody, everybody want to enhance their game for the the millions of dollars, and, and that's what's going on. Everybody trying to enhance their game, and it's it's so crazy that people testing for stuff that ain't that's not even found yet. Next year it'll be banned, but it's not found yet. Mm -hmm. So, uh, man, I don't know. The, the people who are in control, they, they monsters. They monsters and they, they gonna make their money like everybody else trying to make money. Do you think the fight should go on? I don't know. If, if, if the opponent wanna fight two people, then go ahead. If he think he'd be kind of being in whatever he had, then go ahead. If not, then just... Put your family first, make the right decision, and don't take the fight. When your fighters get to the top level, are you going to ask for um, random drug testing? For sure. For sure. Uh, I'm mad I'm, I missed out on uh, for the random drug testing against Brandon Lee when I had Samuel Tia. And you see, once he's been out of Connecticut, where they don't do testing, he looked like shit. He got dropped. And he went 12 rounds with uh, Zachary Ochoa. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, stuff happened. It's all learning is paying for me. I'm still a young kid in coaching. You know what I'm saying? I'm 40 years old, but I'm still young. Shit, you, you would have just been finishing up your career. Yeah, so, mm. you know, I'm still learning.